more XP. I mean, we're getting an okay amount. Um, let's do attack speed. Um, let's max air out. Definitely want summons. Okay. Yo, 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 everybody, what's going on? It is Lotus here back with another Nordic Ashes run. Hopefully, all been doing a okay. Um, if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Every little bit counts, and I do greatly appreciate it. You guys can also tap that bell notification, get notified when a new video goes live. And don't forget to tap the like button down below if you guys end up enjoying. And uh, without further ado, let's jump right on into this. Uh, we're going to play Helga this round, like I said. Um, next episode, we'll play um, the new character, Takor, and we'll see what uh, he's all about. But without further ado, let's jump right on into this. We're going to run Book of Stars on Spartalfheim, and we're going to jump right into normal. And uh, yeah, we're a little less than a thousand, uh, little less than a thousand um, seedlings away, which is pretty cool. So we're slowly, slowly making our way there. Yeah, let's head down this direction. So we're doing good. Can't complain. Boom. Oh, there's this guy down over here. Uh, sure, I guess we'll take that. It's not super, super good, but I'll take it. This is why crit. Oh no, effect prob, okay. Um I mean one plus one damage, sure. We did get the faster speed for producing uh coins, so hopefully we'll get a little more now. Since uh this map we are able to buy from Takor, which definitely I think Takor is really, really good to um buy from because um, his, his upgrades are, like, um, actual, like, so, like, Noki's shop, yeah, you can go there and buy stuff. You might get lucky to buy, like, some, uh, some, like, skill upgrades, but it's more likely, um, new magic tools and stuff. Um, like, Ragdoll, new relics and stuff like that. But, Takor actually affects your stats over here on the, uh, left-hand side that you can actually buy those, which I think are a little more valuable um, in certain situations, rather than buying um, rather than buying the relics and stuff. Like, don't get me wrong, the relics are super good still. Like, depend of course, depending on what relic. Oh man, we got 5 damage minus 2.5% speed on that one too. Okay. Uh, I guess we'll head up to the gold mine now. We haven't, we haven't even leveled up any of our skills yet. Which is pretty pretty crazy. I wouldn't mind getting the XP the XP one. Okay. Guess I'll just hang out right here. I mean, maybe walk around, try and find some more crates and whatnot. Um Projectiles to cool down right out the gate's pretty good. Uh damage, projectiles area. I don't think it I don't think area matters a whole lot. Maybe it does. Yeah, there we go. I want cooldown, cooldown, damage, projectiles. Um, take that one. I'll take that one. Perfect. Perfect. And we'll take Link Split, and we'll get. Oh, there's the XP one. I forgot. She has XP. Crap. XP and attraction. I want both of those. Oh yeah, this is a lot better already. This is a lot better. We don't have a whole lot of gold this round. I mean, we have 35, which is okay. I think we'll definitely end up getting more here. Um, the more crates we can find. I'll, it'll probably be... Um, I think what I'm gonna do, since we're gonna be this, doing the cycle around the wheel, to just hit every character, slowly level up the islands that way, 
so it doesn't get uh, very um, stagnant with just kind of playing the kind of the same character over and over again on like the same on like the same island and whatnot. Um, so what I was thinking was instead of buying um, like using our seedlings to buy stuff like every um, every not every episode because I haven't been doing that, but like every other episode, every two episodes or whatever, I think what I'm gonna do is save them up until we get to Axeldor spend the ones we have and then just constantly keep doing that cycle so every time we get to axeldor we'll spend all of our seedlings to uh, to get leaves and then all of our leaves to just see where see where things get end up um so it'll give us like 10 runs or so in between uh buying stuff and uh we should stack up a quite a bit and we're we'll be able to make some huge progress when uh, the time comes for that so i think it's my plan. <clears throat> I want to make it up here to this big stack of cash. Because I think this will I think this is ten gold. Yeah, ten gold off of that. That's huge. That is huge. Okay. I think there's like three. Okay, that's not too bad. Um guess I'll do that. Um ooh, this is five so you can get what? One, one, five, and ten. Gold, which isn't too bad. Not the two is shabby. Alright. Okay, I don't really want to get near um, this boss. Because of the inverted uh, controls. So we're doing good there. Crit. Blue heart. I mean, we have... Okay, that works. Um, come down here to effect prob. Heck yeah, too easy, dude. Yeah, this is a walk in the park. Um, we have 16 points. Let's throw it into this guy. All into XP now. Um, and then into XP attraction. Should be good. Because we're going to have a ton of XP sitting on the ground. I wouldn't mind getting the 200% um, relic along with the 50% increase for XP. That could be those Both of those could be pretty good. I mean, those two would be super good in like almost any run. So like if I can get them every single run, I'll totally go for them. Because they're both really good to have. So... Oh, uh, yep. Yeah. I'll take plus two projectiles on you. More projectiles just means that it'll last longer. Which I'm perfectly fine with. Okay. Um, yeah, I think we're looking good. I thought we already killed it when it made the squeak there. I was like, dang, we already killed that thing? That's insane. We got the five from that. We killed that. Okay, not bad. Uh, we got no key. We got this. 78 isn't too bad. Oh, look at that. We spoke it into existence. Traction fossil. Yep, I'll take that. Summon meteors from the sky that can burn. I mean, it's on sale. Sure. Um, cool down, cool down our cooldown right now 20% this would bump it up to 30 I mean might as well um plus one bounce this will give us that 2.5% movement speed back receive half a heart less damage each time you're hit I mean this is it's not gonna matter for us I'll take this for sure one bounce could be interesting <clears throat> I don't know if this can bounce though I mean, we'll take it, I guess. Why not? Why not? Um, 25% cooldown. Have at least one blue heart. Um, I'm going to take the cooldown there. 10% attack speed. Sure. Sure. And then let's head on out. Um, let's get this one. Let's get this. 
But she bumped up us up to like what? 360? Okay, not bad. Uh we'll get you. We'll get you. We'll get two red heart containers or heal one red heart. Let's go two red heart containers. We'll get you. Um Do I wanna go ace or air? I think I'm gonna go air this round. Yeah, I'm gonna go air. Okay. Let's see, uh, let's head over this way. I feel pretty good about- ooh, this is new. Doesn't seem to work, it just bounces on your screen. Huh, I want that. That's a new one that we haven't seen before. At a tower, uh, gallery or whatever. Our codex. Okay. Hang out here, we'll get this. I think we're making some pretty good progress. Um, we have huge XP range, range, so I'm not worried about that at all. Hey, look at that! XP's way out there. We can collect it all the way out to here, it's like that near that stone pillar. That is insane. All right. Um. Okay. So we got a lot of stuff falling down from the sky. Ooh, this could be huge. As long as we don't get hit, which we... We only got hit once, and that was because I walked into something. So we're doing okay, okay there. Oh, shit. Oh, we got hit there. <laughs> okay. Got two chests, not bad. Um, damage. I'd rather get it on the book. Two projectiles, okay. I'd rather get book upgrades rather than, uh, the other one, so. We have four XP points. Not quite sure what exactly I'm going to... Well, I definitely want to max out um, projectile speed, attack speed, um, maybe duration. Uh, I don't know. I don't know on that one. Okay. And oh, we cannot get hit. Okay. Oh, they do do damage. So they bounce off the side of your screen, which is pretty cool. That must have been crazy to pro- I feel like that must have been pretty hard to program. Because everybody's screens are different sizes. Unless they just have it programmed into, like, the size of the, uh... Damn it. Into the, um... Like the... The adjustable in your, um... Settings. Where you can set your uh, screen display settings for the width and height of the screen. Okay, we need to upgrade something here. Uh, critical damage. I'm on damage. I feel like these two rotate. Um, I'm going you. You. Okay. Probably should have maxed out air. Or not air. Uh, yeah, air. But we didn't. Okay. Critical gives us 25%. Not a lot. It's okay. Okay. Ew. Not that it matters because we already got hit and lost the, uh, Lost the, uh, ice dagger or whatever it is. Crystal dagger. That's okay. That's okay. Just gonna run around, try and collect as much XP as possible. I mean, we're doing pretty good. 
I just wish we could get more, um... More XP. I mean, we're getting an okay amount. Um, let's do attack speed. Um, let's max air out. Definitely want summons. Okay. I just want more summons, so, like, as I'm walking, the chances of stuff that gets inside of our, like, inner ring, if we don't have the, um, Book of Stars rolling, like, we can kill the stuff that's, like, right on top of us. The Book of Stars doesn't get to it. So. Looking pretty good, though. I'd like to get more gold, though. 16 gold is not great. A little bit of a bummer. So I'd like to try and get more if possible. Okay. I mean, it doesn't look too bad. Definitely need to try and. There we go. There we go. There's some gold happening here. Not a lot, but we got some going. Okay. Like, we're getting a good, good amount of XP, but we're, we are getting a little overwhelmed. Like, Book of Stars, I feel like, isn't super, super great for this. Um, just because we are, like, it just seems, it, it seems a little slow, because we are still getting overwhelmed a little bit. So, oh, shit. Here is the Book of Stars. We need the Book of Stars to go on her. Or him, or... Whatever the ogre is. Or orc. Okay. Slowly getting there, slowly but surely. We're almost there, we're almost there, we're almost there. Boom, you're dead. I like that boss. It's a very, very easy boss to fight. Okay, um, let's grab another one of you. We're not burning or poisoning anything. Full of blue red heart container. I mean, it's tempting. Two empty red heart containers. Yeah, I'll take that. Okay. Damage, damage. Okay, let's roll. Damage. Um, one empty red heart container. Um, let's roll. Oh, we don't have enough. Okay, cool. Well, let's, let's head down out of here. Um, let's get this one maxed out. Okay. This. We'll do this. I was getting 200% movement speed. Do that. Um, let's do duration to start. <clears throat> then we'll go into area. And then we'll probably get... Uh, I'd say probably cards would be my guess. We could just get rid of all four of these two. But we'll hold on to them. Like, I don't think we need to get rid of them. Oh, turn all your red hearts into blue hearts? I don't think so. Even though I already started it, which is a bit of a bummer. I mean, I don't think it's really going to matter a whole lot if we do. It's just we'll lose that, we'll lose a bunch of our hearts because I think you can only cap out at 14, so we definitely don't want to do that. But, I mean, we're <clears throat> we're doing good. I think Book of Stars, I don't know. It felt really good the first round we went on uh, Midgard. But this is normal on this island. And it felt like we were starting to get a little overwhelmed with the Book of Stars. Um, I mean, air, of course, feels pretty good now. Like, if we went with air from the start, I don't think we would have had a problem. Like, at all. So, 
I think I think Book of Stars is slowly starting to fall off in a way. Which is, isn't the end of the world. Like, we have some other stuff that we can run that's really good, so... Not really too worried on any of that. Do you still want to pick up a lot of gold since we have Takor that we can uh, go to um, before we go and fight the final boss? So we definitely want to get that going. Um, let's get this. Let's buy the rest of this. Um, and then buy cards just to get something else going because this oh, getting overwhelmed a little bit here, I don't, I really don't like. <laughs> we'll grab that. Give us something good. Um, yeah, I'll take 5% cooldown. Bumps us up to 60% cooldown, which is pretty good. I think. Okay. I mean, we're up to 145 seedlings, which isn't too bad. Okay. Looking good, looking good, baby. Alright. And the huge thing is that we have the, um, <clears throat> the XP ring for, uh, when we, um, finish here. That's, like, the biggest thing. I mean, if I can get, like, another 50 gold, that'd be huge, but I don't think that's gonna happen. God damn it, why did I just keep... Like, I can see where I'm walking, and I just walk right into it. Okay. Dazed and confused. Alright, it looks like we got two down here. Oh, three down there, okay. Uh, we got some gold up here. Okay. Three there. I mean, we are getting a good amount of gold drops. That's for sure. We're up to 26. No, no big gold drops. I'd like the big gold piles, but that's okay. Alright. Let's make our way over here. Interesting. Okie dokie. I mean, only three gold out of this one, which isn't the end of the world. But it's slowly stacking up. I mean, we'll get out of here with probably like 45 gold. Be my guess. Okay. It's okay. We can take the hits. More gold. Imagine getting the plus two and you can have up to four hearts from he over healing. That's going to be insane. Alright, we're looking good. We're looking really good, actually. Gold-wise, I mean, a little under what I was kind of expecting, but that's okay. That's okay. I mean, we are doing pretty good. Okay, we'll pop this. This will put us up for probably, like... Oh, not very high at all. Thought we were going to get more out of that. Um... Let's go with this one, I guess. Ooh, let's get Helga's ultimate. Max duration, or max uh, area. Okay, that works. Uh, cooldown. Um, bounce is kind of irrelevant in a way. Um, what is that? Attack speed. Sure. I'll take the damage. Um, I don't really need any of that. Cooldown, sure. Damage, sure. Uh, duration. I mean, that's all you're giving me. I might as well take it. All right, Takor, wish me luck, brother. Okay, we should probably blow through a Sindri pretty quick. Um, okay, we're not blowing through them as quickly as I thought we were going to blow through them. I mean, I'll take the boss hits right now. Okay, he's dead. Cool. Cool! We unlock that skin, which is pretty sick. Alright, not bad, not bad. So this has been Nordic Ashes. If you guys enjoyed, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Greatly appreciate it, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace out!